So name from Dr. Smoke. What do we have here? We got Bob. We got Bob. He's always helping us. Thank you, buddy. Uh, we've got an Inkbird Plus smoking gun. Now, you'd think because we knew a lot about smoking, we'd know about this. Correct. I don't know much about this. <laughs> you probably don't know much about this because you're watching this video. I've got an Inkbird Plus smoking gun. I, I actually do use their products. I, I've got their, uh, their Wi-Fi thermometers work great. You know, okay. good company. Check them out. Uh, there are definitely a lot of different variations of this. So today we're going to just do an unboxing in this video. Then the video down here, down here. Down here. will be... Where's the corner? That, it'll it's be down here. Down here? Down, yeah, down, down here. there. Right okay. at the bottom somewhere. All right. Uh, we'll put a link in the video for the next one. What we're going to do is we're going to test it. See if, if we can taste the difference. Absolutely. With, you know, yep. with, some, with, some, with some smoke. Yep. To see how effective it is. Because I'm kind of leery about it. But I, these are popular though. I've seen them on cooking shows. The You've judges seen. say they work. Let's right. find out. We know what smokers taste like. Let's see what we can do with it. Exactly. We're only going to use lemon later. But let's get into this. Let's open this up. Again, this thing says it's for turkey, beef, fish, cheese, and, and cocktails. A whiskey is huge. Whiskey, yes. You know, smoked yep. whiskey. And yep. I have customers that, that use something similar okay. uh, for this. So we're going to open this bad boy up. Again, we don't know anything about it. Bob, you know anything about this? No. So here's some instructions. Open them up. And we've got... We've got a... It looks like a gasket... And a piece of glass. That is, yeah. So I'm sure that sure somehow it's somewhere. Yep. Yeah. Uh, next, we have different wood chips. We've got a hickory, okay. Like a hickory like starter kit. Yeah. Apple. We've got oak. So all the different little chips. Mm -hmm. Very neat. And then we've got pear. Okay. Pear wood. Pear wood. Ooh. Uh, beech. Nice little assortment comes with it. And mm -hmm. let's see. Cherry. And cherry. All right. Cool. So we've got Very six nice. different uh, flavors to try. We're going to do one. Uh, we'll let Bob pick whatever we're going to use. Okay. Now we've got so tweezers. Tweezers. Screen. And it looks like a little cleaner. Yeah, it looks, it looks like, like a Dremel kit. tool. Yeah, it does. Uh, we've got this doohickey. I'm not sure what it is yet. We'll put it together. Again, this is our first unboxing. We don't we don't know what we're getting ourselves into. That looks like the hose, the fitting at it the end. That does look like the fitting, yep. A hose. A hose. Looks like a standard rubber hose. Yep. And we've got the device. How this device starts or how it's powered, I'm not sure. We're going to find out. But <clears throat> So... If somebody's gonna open one of these up and, and check it out, you know, quality wise, this uh, top plate here is aluminum. Mm -hmm. it says Inkbird Plus. Uh, you got an on and off switch here, uh, plastic design. I'm not sure exactly what the bottom is yet until we build it. Yeah, yeah. But uh, overall, it, it seems like it's gonna be a, a fairly light, light unit to use. Right. Uh, again, you'll probably put this down and let the thing smoke for a while. So we're gonna we're gonna put this together real quick, kind of look at the instructions on camera. Again, we're new to this too, so if you're watching this, you might be looking at this review to see if you want to purchase it. So I have to say, you were talking about unboxing. Look at this boxing. This was really nicely kept. You're not gonna open it up and find your pieces all over and possibly broken. They got a lot of cushioning in here, and it was all nicely organized. He was able to pull it all in one shot. That's Right. That's a rarity anymore. Right. Get a lot of stuff just thrown together. And we weren't paid for this review. So so we're not being paid for this. Okay. Uh, it was $64 on Amazon. That's what we paid for it. And we'll, we'll, we'll put it together. Yep. Uh, this is my first comparison. Never using one of these. So, you Never know, used so one far, either. so good. The only other one I knew about was uh, one from Poly Science. And, and the only reason is because I work in the science industry. Okay. So... I tried bugging one of the reps for one one day, and he goes, oh, that's a different division, da da da, da and I gave it up. So gotcha. that's about all I know. Right. All right, so number one, Bob. Number one. We're going to put the the rubber hose Under and the metal guy. fitting, and then we're going to put that on the end Are here. You want that end? Yes, I'll take that I'll take end. take this end? So, so far, so pretty easy. So far, pretty easy. All right. Hose is all the way on. All right, all right, let's start smoking the salmon. All right. Oh, we got yeah. no salmon. Okay, no salmon. Nothing. So now, 
instruction number two is we are going to take the provided screen. And I don't want to say what this reminds me of, but mm -hmm. definitely. If you know, you know. If you know, you know. Uh, let's just drop that in, I think, right? It just says place mesh filter in the hopper and press it to be at the bottom of the hopper. Okay, okay. done. All right. Now, put the hopper metal in the chamber. That so must be that guy. Okay. Yep. That's the doohickey. I didn't know what it was. Yep. Then that guy goes there. You've got your screen at the bottom. Prevent stuff yep. going in. So okay. now, push the trigger forward to activate the fan. No fan because we probably need batteries. Mm. Battery installation. Battery installation. Okay. Pull up the cover. So we do need to put batteries in this. I told you to read the directions, Bob. I can't read it if we don't unbox it. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we didn't pre-open this. Uh, so oh, we it looks need batteries. like we need batteries, and they're going to be... Triple A? Double A. Triple A or double A? Double A. Four double A batteries. Four double A batteries. I'm going to go get those, and uh, we'll put a pause on this. Pause. Boop. We're back with the uh, batteries. Got the batteries. <laughs> we got the batteries now. <laughs> I don't know if the unit was rechargeable. Um, no, yeah. And I'm sure that's the different features of other units is, you know, you get a charging battery. But, right. hey, four double A's is no big deal. I mean, one less USB cord you got to worry about where it's at. Exactly. So, we'll go ahead and put these in. Then this cover just kind of snaps on. There we go. And there we go. All right. So, at this point, I think this should turn on now. There it goes. I hear a fan. Well, that's really quiet, too. Very quiet. And on the box, it actually did say low noise, uh, below 60 decibels. And I was like, oh, what is that for? Right now, that's really quiet. Yeah. So now, once that top cover's on, we do need to put some chips in there. So, Bob, what do you want to put in there uh, just for the test to see if we can get an aroma? You know, like what seems interesting to you? Pear wood. You know what? I was going to pick the same. Yeah, one. I haven't smoked because, it before, so. Because pear wood, you're like, really? Pear wood? Pear. All right. It's got a so nice, now, you know, fragrant, when you bite into a pear, taste pork chops with a pear, you get that. So let's see what a pear tastes like. Yeah. Yep. So, pear so wood, pear, sorry. Pear wood tastes like. It smells like wood. That smells like apple. wood. Yeah. So now it says put in the hopper metal chamber. Put some wood chips or other smoking material into the hopper. Yeah. So put some. some metal mesh. So the metal mesh doesn't go in. Hold on a minute. Does the metal mesh go into... No. No, it says right there in the hopper. Place the you mesh stepped over the hopper. A, you stepped over a word. So I messed up. This gets pressed into the bottom of the hopper. Read the instructions. Because I was wondering how the heck the wood chips weren't just going to fall through mm -hmm. here. So now we will do it right. Like, like the saying, measure twice, cut once. You know? Exactly. So now... We've got some wood chips. So does it say fill it? Uh, it just says put the hopper in the metal chamber, then put some wood chips or other smoking material into the hopper. Okay. So I mean I think that's enough. Oh, you did. We're really not reading these instructions too well. No, we're not. Well, we're no. on camera. We're under pressure. Yeah. I'm not. You're not. You no. know I got a secret to tell. Do you? Yeah. Not you. You already know. But. Oh. Those guys. Those guys. There is a secret. Is yes. It? What about this? Well, it's not really a secret. Guys and girls, yes. Can we tell everybody? We tell everybody. All of them? All of them, yeah. Okay. So, yeah, there's something I'll tell you at the end of the video. Okay. It, it really hasn't been kept as a secret intentionally. I got another secret to tell you. Do you? I read ahead. Did you? Read step five. Step five, we need a lighter. <laughs> we need a lighter. <laughs> we need a lighter. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so, we're going to go get a lighter now. We're going to get a lighter. We're back after, again. After a short commercial break, <laughs> we're back with the lighter. <laughs> All right. Um, so, Bob, put this in your mouth. All right. And then we got to turn on the fan. <laughs> All right. So... We should see it come out the end. Yeah, we really should see it come out the yeah. end. So, now what we're going to do, we're just going to... We're going to power up the little fan that's going to run, and we're going light to the, light the hopper. Yep. Uh, this is just demonstrational purposes for this video. Uh, the next video, we are going to smoke yes. this and see if we can see a difference. <laughs> All right. So we'll power that on. I hear the fan very quietly, but I hear it. Hear the fan? Oh, and you actually feel it. Oh, yeah, look at that. So now we will light.
Here it comes. Check that out. Check that out. Hope that's being picked up good on the camera. That's a lot of smoke. Yeah, it is. It really wow. is. Wow. Wow. And that's why I wanted to do that. And, and you're not even need to sit there and hold it anymore. No, it's because it kind of yep. it pulls the air the through. The airflow keeps the fire going. Look at that. Exactly. That I mean, that thing worked good. Really good. I'm gonna jump, jump behind here. It. How's it smell? The aroma oh, it smells good. <sighs> really oh, good. Yeah. Really good. Wow, All that's right. that's a lot. It really is. Off that little wood, we put a very few amount of wood chips yeah, in there. Yeah, I mean, look at look at the container, right? That's going to do several smokes. Oh, exactly. Surprisingly, I thought maybe this was a test and that's it. This will do several. Yep. So I'm going to shut this off because it's, it's actually filling it's this, up, yeah. this fairly large pole barn with smoke. The smoke tank is going to so, go So, smoking gun, I would say this works. Absolutely. It's functional. Absolutely. Very cool product. Inkbird Plus. Check it out. I'm going to put a link in there and I actually have a promotional code Oh, for everybody watching. Saving some money. That's one of my secrets. I've got a wow. promotional code for you in the description. Another thing I wanted to mention before we conclude the uh, unboxing is the fact that I've been keeping a secret from you, Dr. Smoke, and then Bob has too because he's actually helped film other videos. So we have another channel. Check it out. It's called How To's and Reviews. Again, that'll be linked in the description. Bob has helped me do various videos in that. We did uh, the Mud Busters, the Mud Busters, mud busters uh, yep, for the for side the by side. Side by side. Yep. We have some videos on there. So if you like us, check us out because we're there. Uh, I've got a couple friends that, that help out with that one. And uh, again, check this out Inkbird Plus Smoking Gun. 64 bucks on Amazon, and I'm sure that varies based on of sure. Amazon pricing. Yep, and the sales are going on, but right. I, this is phenomenal. This is perfect if you have a small house, maybe an apartment, and you can't get a smoker. Right. I'm telling you, the, the smell in here smells like we're using the smokers. It's exactly. Amazing. Like, I, I wish I should almost like powder the room with this for when customers come because I can right? say, could. yes, it's a smoker shop. Yes. You know? But yes. no, it smells phenomenal. It, it does. works really well. It does. It takes a lighter, some batteries, and, and you've got a really good mechanism to smoke things. Yep. Again, this is Dr. Smoke. Don from Dr. Smoke. Bob. Bob, Bob from Dr. Smoke. Bob. Might as well At be this point. from Dr. Smoke. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Please like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Thank we, you for we've, watching. We, we've got a lot of stuff coming yes. for you guys. Yes. Uh, content's changing a little bit. And uh, we'll see you soon. Out of here.